Yo, what's going on everyone? It's your boy King J. Welcome to another episode of Teach Me Where the Pro Players Teach Me How to Use Their Main Character. We went to Spain to go and find the finest Feng player in the world. You know, old school people know him, the new players know him, everyone knows who he is, Mr. Kaipa. Very, very strong player and yeah, he's overall, you know, a friendly person as well. So the information that you'll find out if you really want to know Feng, this will be the guy to watch on the season four changes. If you lot like tech and content, you lot need to subscribe. There's a lot of quality content coming on this channel that is tech and related and we're gonna be doing FGC stuff as well. So subscribe, leave a comment and smash the like button. Let's get into it. Okay, go to the wall. I want to try something. Okay, cool. Uh, Crouch. Oh, it, it can be difficult. Crouch and block, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Did what? you know that? <laughs> what? <laughs> man, oh man, we're back again. Another Teach Me episode and we're here with Kaipa. Now, thank you for being on the show, man. Thank you for inviting me, Kinja. All right, man, I appreciate it. We're going to get into the thing, season yeah. four stuff. Take it away. <laughs> Okay, so well, I'm I'm happy with the season four changes because I feel like Feng now is better. Is he's better? He has the same problems maybe that the season three and season two, but he's stronger in his strong point. You know what I mean? He's better in the stuff that he was good. So that's good. The first change I want to talk about it yeah. is one plus two. Yeah. One plus two now, in my opinion, is sick because don't move, don't move. Check it. Oh, let me. Yeah. Let me from here. Yeah. The range. Oh well, maybe the position from Feng uh, make yeah. it with, but the range now yeah. is much bigger. Yeah. And now yeah. it is only minus twelve. You know what that means? For example, yeah. uh, the, uh, Steve has a very difficult time against Feng because now yeah. he can't punish that. Yeah. Uh, only Steve only can punish yeah. from here, you know. But from yeah. here, try for example do one two on block. Yeah. Check it. And it's only 12, you know? Yeah. You can't do 13, you can't do 14. Yeah. It was 13 before, yeah. and yeah. Steve before could do something like back one, two. So in some spots, this move yeah. now is safe because mm. the pushback yeah. is very high. The range yeah. is very nice also. Mm. And uh, the, the frames, the frame from the parry, it was from yeah. two to seven. Mm. Now it parries from yeah. two to nine. That's much better, you know? So you have better setups and you have various options. The yeah. damage is very high. And there is a very, very nice combo. Try to do something like one, two, one, two, please. Okay, this is the, the parry. And now, okay, do it again. Ah, difficult. Again, because perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, I don't have the pin here, but the stone in that situation and then down for granted. And you have a lot of different uh, traps from, from the character. So one plus two now is very, very strong. Even on normal hit, what walk forward, please. You can do that combo also. Very easy, but yeah, this is very, very easy combo. Try it, try it. So one plus two, dash, uh, shoulder. Yeah. Let me try it. Yeah, again. You don't need to dash so deep. You can just... Yeah, oh, like there this. We check, go. check the damage. Check the damage. Whoa. Crazy. That's mad. No? You just have to get used to the timing of it, though. Yeah, that that move is super strong now, and also uh, tracks a little bit. So sometimes people is like, okay, I can, I'm waiting for something like back one. I'm waiting from up forward two. I'm waiting for some evasive move from Feng, you know. But one plus two sometimes hits you. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. you, like, you, can, you can use that like a parry, but a lot of a lot of times that hits the opponent because he's trying to do side step, blah blah blah, or something like move and attack. So one plus two now yeah. is much better. Only minus twelve, big yeah. damage, very easy to to check the combo, and uh, the punch parry from two to the nine frame. So I love that move. Yeah. Okay, Five. cool. Yeah. Yeah. What? Sorry. Check check the damage. That's if you have great drive, you can wall splat also. You know? Seriously, that's crazy. Yeah, of course. Yeah, that's super, super good. So the next move I want to talk about is the down four up four three. That move changed the the way that Feng can do combos. You know, because 
in season three they changed everyone knows this new screen to end the combos but now with down four four three you have a mid from 15 frames that you can use to wall splat only minus six minus six so you can do something like back one up two blah 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 and also tail spin so in the past uh, this combo you had to delay the second one okay to do that effect yeah but now with the new move with down four up four three you can do that you know oh wow yeah so that's better also mm. and you can mix it with down four up four two because in the past a lot of pen players we were talking about the same that down four up four is good because good range but uh in season two only down four up four after down four up four two but this was minus 11. now you have the safer option you know the opening can crouch but you can do the seg uh, the two down four up four two mm -hmm. you can also do only the first one so the opening is thinking okay down four up four now me now hi what he goes to do and you can do something like blah blah you know so mm. um check it on hit try down four up four three plus 13. i have guard but you know, plus 13 uh, give you free mix up. For example, uh, try the headbutt. This one? Yeah, do. Now I done 4 4 3 yeah. into headbutt, you know? Okay. Oh, it's my bad. Yeah, it'll be difficult sometimes. But you know, if I try to attack. What's that? <laughs> Is it, it's, oh, it's, it's, quite, it's, quite, it's quite weird. I know. I know. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but check it. I can't even you didn't kill that slow, but I could I could do anything nothing, you know? So yeah. that's very good. Free pressure now. And good damage also. 32 damage is okay. And you know, different different mix up. And now the next change that I love is dumbbell one two. Okay? Mm -hmm. A lot of people doesn't know that. Uh, because dumbbell one two uh, in the past was uh, minus twelve. Now it's minus eleven. That's very good, you know, because twelve punish a uh, character with 12 punish are, are very strong now 11 punish are you know uh, weaker so that's interesting and also if the opponent try to interrupt your stream for example you can do something like blah blah you can mm, try the high See, if the opponent try a uh, press some button after, after dumbbell one you can delay the second and okay check it do dumbbell one and then two okay I will try to press. Yes, yeah, number one, two. Only this one, okay? Check it. And everyone thinks, okay, I can do the shoulder, right? Mm -hmm. This is what every, everyone thinks. But check it. I got to show you something. All right, show me. Uh, block the first one, mm -hmm. and then press something, ball, okay? Okay. You can what with that, yeah. No one knows that. <laughs> yeah. Nah, this teach me is crazy. You're, you're yeah. showing me so much crazy things. All right, cool. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. What? So, yeah, that's super good because you can do, for example, uh, if the wall is closed, you can do race drive, wall splat, side step, the manga four, the other wall, blah blah blah. So that's very interesting, you know. Yeah. And you can you can delay it, delay it a lot. You, you can do like check it. Mm. You, you know what I mean? You can. Yeah, delay. It. Also, also miss, miss, mix the options. Okay, so down back one, two, only minus eleven. That's good. Also, on counter hit, you can check down back one into four or into two. Okay. Oh. You and you can. Yeah. You want me to press? Yeah, press, press. Ah, there we go. Check it and free mix up also after that move. And check the damage. The shoulder damage is. 45, down forward to 2. Okay, for 47 plus 1 damage from the wall. Yeah. So, not against every character, but the most of them. Okay, not against, for, for example, Ling Xiaoyu or Nina, they are small characters, so uh, you can use down forward to 2, but you have the option there against a lot of male characters. Okay, so okay. keep it in mind. Okay. okay, and now I got to talk about my favorite change. Oh, sorry. Okay. Yeah, check it. 36 damage from Dumbak 3. <laughs> Dumbak 3 is maybe my favorite move with Pen. Yeah. Because it's homing. I check the range. Okay. Check the range after quarter figure forward. <laughs> Sick, right? That's crazy. And crouch. I want to show you something. From this range, this is minus 15. You can check it, right? Mm -hmm. 
that. Let me try. Okay. I have different setups too. 15 also. 14, 14 right? Yeah. This is kinda tricky, you know, because if the opponent doesn't know exactly the situation and they try to punish you with 15, you can just block and punish, you know. Mm. So, this new animation, uh, let me land you on control, made, uh, makes the down back three uh, kinda different, you know, because on the past it was only uh, positive mm -hmm. and 14 damage, but now 35 damage uh, give the move at different spots where you, you when you can use them you know what i mean it's like before you you start from poking from far from but now you can use dumbback three to defend now if you land it on counter hit you can get something big you know what i mean yeah so you can move it like this blah, blah, use that and if you land it big damage and the situation is super good also super good check it if you try to do anything except the Three plus four. Uh, how to say that on English? Uh, spring kick, right? Yeah. If you try a spring kick, you defeat me. Well, the Feng spring kick is different, but yeah. with the most of uh, character, character you can use a spring kick. But if you do anything else, down four is guaranteed back turn. Try, try press back after down back three, okay? Okay. Yeah. Check it. You can escape, but you can't punish. So, safe option, okay? But you have you have the down three back turn. So if you check the damage, 36 plus plus 40 is this 50 damage. On season three with down back three on counter hit, it was like 15, 16 damage because the uh, counter hit effects give you more damage. Mm -hmm. But now you can get from the setup like 50 damage. You can also uh, bait the opponent just pressing back. If they try anything, it will whiff for free and the punish is very easy. Try something like a three from the ground, okay? Right. Free, totally free. Nothing to, you know, nothing to worry about. Okay, so. Combo. So, now uh, I feel like Feng has a good mid, uh, I, sorry, uh, a good uh, counter hit from long range, very good. It's something similar to maybe a large dumbback four, but I prefer Feng dumbback three because the range is sick, very very sick. Okay, it's homing mm -hmm. and plus four or from long distance plus five. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah. so the situation is super good. You can do something like, oh, sorry, I tried to do. The, you can go for do, both of them, or you can go for this into this if they try block the second one the frame the start of frames is 16 so you can mix with them for a 4 3 the new move also okay yeah. so think about a uh, thing is getting better on the on that small part right the the counter hit two and uh, the situations from down back three are, on counter hit are super good for Feng. okay super super good also uh, can you pick a character with a normal spring kick I want to show you this. I think this is very important. From the okay, Dumbak cool. Three. Yeah, yeah. You, no. you're, you're player one. That's fine. Ah, okay. I can do it. Though. Yeah. Like maybe yeah. Jin, Jin or Mishima or something like that. Yeah, something like that. Something like that. Yeah. Okay. So player one. Uh, double Jin. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I got to try to uh, do that on Parsec because uh, to the Feng players, mm -hmm. they will be very happy if they know that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's cool. Okay. Control. Perfect. So do a spring kick. Okay. Okay. We have different options. Just press back. Okay? Yeah. But if you think you need to keep going with the pressure and, and you, you think, okay, maybe he can do the spring kick. You can do this. Oh, I can. Let me try. Oh. You can back turn, uh, press forward and keep the pressure, you know? Yeah. I got to try back four. Oh, wow. Oh. oh. Ah, because I yeah, have the side. Okay, you can, with Parsec is a little, a little bit difficult, but you can turn back and keep going, you know? Oh, wow. That's good. You can try the hard read, something like, okay, I go to back, oh, sorry. I go to uh, just press back, this is a safe situation, but mm. then you can let them escape 
Mm. But if you think, okay, what's he going to do? I don't know. I go to do a safer pressure instead something like down four. Okay, but check it. Sometimes losing the space. Or down three, which if they if they uh, stand up approaching, they will block it. Yeah. You can go for that kind of situation. Try try against Sprinky. Okay. Let's make you defeat also that situation. Also the one. Okay. That. Uh, one plus two defeated. Okay. Yeah. But you know that one plus two is kind of risky because if the opponent just stands on the ground, they will punish you after. So in my opinion, the two good options are just uh, turn, turn back okay. or uh, just uh, go forward with the normal move. Yeah, something like uh, do forward. Okay, instead after down back three, instead press back. This is back. Check yeah. it. Press forward. Faster. Okay. Yeah. So you can keep going. Okay. So okay. Now there is small changes, like for example, down back four and down three from back turn that they changed the, the hitbox. Okay, but it's the same. Yeah. And they increase the range of back to three. Okay. Back to three. This is good because uh, mm, we we want to use that move in some advantage, uh, some some advanced uh, setups. Okay. Yeah. Because this move on back turn is. Check it, don't, don't move, okay? Okay. Do quick roll, okay? Okay. What? Quick roll again? Oh, I can't do that on Parsec. Yeah, yeah. What <laughs> is. Yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. And if you do quick roll, that's kind of also. So, back two, three, four. I like it. It deals more damage. And some, some players use that on their, on their wall combo. We want to check it, okay? Yeah. Because they add more damage to some moves on, on the screen. Okay, but let me try. Uh, one parsec is in the difficult for me to do on clean, you know? Yeah. yeah. But the last on clean it deals a good damage and you can keep going the pressure. So, uh, in my opinion, the next interesting change is the up of three, okay? Mm -hmm. They didn't change the throwing data, they didn't change the damage, but now, the range of the attack is lower. Check it when you can read mid, okay? Yeah. Very low, right? So now uh, opponents can't crush this move. On the past, a lot of moves like, for example, down back three or even down back two with double G yeah. uh, could uh, crush that move. And that move is super good because 21 frame, you have mix up after. If the opponent try to wake up, a four, a four, three, four is guaranteed, okay? If I don't. Oh, let me do gap kick here. Yeah. Okay, you just can just pressing up is it works, but okay. So they have to respect that situation. Yeah. But now it's lower, so you don't go to find again that's you know that situation where the opponent you, you did the low crash, you did the mid low crash, the opponent did the low and you lost. You know, that's still to me a lot. And that move also close to the wall can give you a combo sometimes. Yeah. So it's a good move. And something very interesting about a 4 3 also. Block it. Check it. Check the frame data. On block. Minus 2 only. <laughs> so if you try 1 1 or you try something like that, I can't, you know. So a 4 3 now is very interesting to use. So seeing as that's minus 2, if I press jab, your 1 plus 2 would, would be it, right? Yeah. Now, right. On the, because the change, because mm -hmm. before it was from 2 to 7. Mm. So. Uh, now it's from 2 to 9, the parry, so yeah, I can do something yeah. like that. And also, very interesting, try 1-1. One, one. Okay. Okay. So the opponent, to defeat your down back 3, needs to use a down for 1, a, a very fast mid, right? Because if they use other stuff, try for example side step, okay? Mm -hmm. Down back 3 will land it. Okay? It's check. It's totally broken. <laughs> <laughs> okay, homing, homing, homing low, out of range. And even uh, the counter hit situation with Dumbak 3 is very, very, very tasty now. It's very, very strong. So, we have other stuff very, very, very interesting. Pop 2. It has a very long range now. Don't move, check it. Okay, let me try. Okay, the range is super good, right? I'm only minus 9. 
So that move deals a good damage, gives you good Okisame on hit. And now uh, it's reached very, very, very far. That's very, very interesting for me. I, I, I'm learning now because I was I didn't play too much Tekken the, the last months, but now this is my third week in a row playing Fen. And I'm I feel like 4 4 2 is a very nice addition to the to the set. Yeah. Because 18 frame is like 4 4 down back 3, you know? It's true 50 50 in some situation. But well, I don't go to do <laughs> go so deep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I love it. Now also 4 4 4 3, the the they increased the lower range of the attack. Okay. So check where it appears on practice mode. Okay, now this is better because in the past uh, it happened so, something similar to a 4 3, okay? That people could go under the mid, and that's I, I didn't like that. So <laughs> they made that change, okay? And something very interesting I, I was crying on Twitter many, many times that Feng hadn't a good way standing punish uh, from 13 frames, and that was a problem, okay? Yeah. Because now you have West standing 1 2, it was 14 on the past. Now it is 13 or something like one, okay? Mm -hmm. That's very good because check it, don't move. Uh, watch me, watch me. Yeah. Okay, press forward. Okay, now we can. This is like now like a down 401 with uh, Devil Jin or with Lars or with Miguel, you know, but from full screen. Like, wait, because it's minus one, 13 frames, and Fengo minus one is super good. So now you can use better the West standing one. And also, if you land the last hit of the swing, we're sending one to one. If you land it on counter hit, uh, try to press after the second hit, okay? You have free shoulder. Okay? Yeah. So now they have they have the opponent have to has to respect your string because it was only plus one, it's only plus one. But now if you press, it gives you very, very big damage. Okay, that's very interesting. 14, 48 damage is yeah. a very, very good damage. Okay, so now Feng has the third, uh, 13 frames. Spanish, we're standing. It has a reason to don't press after. Because I remember when I, I was playing against Go High, John Dean, JDCR, everyone against Feng after they were standing one to one hit. Everyone was pressing bottoms because they didn't care about the third one. You know? Before it was like you only got a, a, a wall splat if you was on the wall, but... Mm. And something very interesting now is the while standing 2. Okay? The while standing 2, before in the past, it was minus 9. And uh, on hit, it was the same effect that on on counter hit was the same. That on the past, it... Gave, gave you a very small combo. The combo was something like back four, down four, ba ba, okay? But now, on counter hit, it gives you full combo. Okay? So, sorry. Oh, well, give me a second. Yeah, can do, do, do you think that's a good change or a bad change then? A good change because in the past, you didn't get only. You only got a small combo, right? Now you can use that like that, like moving, blah, 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 moving and bam, okay? Yeah. Oh. So good, good parry. Okay, the damage is okay. Now you have a counter catcher, you know. On the past, you couldn't. Uh, sometimes with Feng, people wasn't scared of attack you. You know, it's not the best move because the range is short, very short. Okay, yeah. shake it the range. But you can use that from uh, the dash. Okay, so. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh. What's the best way to do that dash that you're doing? Is it quarter circle forward up, quarter circle forward up? Yeah, yeah. This is what I do. Look at that, your inputs down, down. Yeah. yeah, that looks uh, smooth. Yeah. That's very good. Uh, let me try. Okay. okay. On player one, I can do it better. To show people. Go under. Okay. You know. We're, we're, on you we're on parsec though, so. Yeah, 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 we're on parser, so. Yeah. But anyway, now Feng has a tool to use if you think the opening go to press on bottom, you know? Mm. In the past, uh, you could do 4-4 four, four, straight, you could do down 4-1, four, you could do down 4-4, four, four, but uh, it, uh, while other characters, for example, Debbie Ying can use down 4-2, Negan can use a 4-4, four, four, 
uh, looking for get the a counter hit on the opponent yeah. with faint you couldn't no mm. now you can use oh sorry oh, <laughs> yeah now you're good you're good yeah. if you try to do something here try press the bottom of the number three okay. okay now you have something to do oh, um, this is full combo but on parsec it's kind of difficult Oh yeah, trade because for only plus four here. Yeah. But the interesting part is that if you know the opponent go to try something, you can okay and get the full combo. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now a change that I don't find very interesting, but we have to talk about them. Is on the past I, I don't know why this move is six yet. Okay. Maybe to mix with I don't know with what question on four one. But this move on block is minus fourteen. And this move is uh, 18, you know, and it doesn't even high crash, you know. Yeah. Do do something like one, one, one. Okay. Take it. Okay. You can interrupt it. So we're standing three. It's better because it's high crash. It's only minus 12 instead of minus 14, and uh, it's faster, right? So I don't know the reason because I don't know why this move exists. But it's here, okay? so we have to talk about them, uh, about him. And uh, now on hit, it's closer, so you can get always the big combo mm. with first cancer for one plus two. On the pass, that combo got you some problems. But uh, uh, I don't know the reason. It's better, okay? I, it's closer. You can do the big combo, but a good thing will never use this move. Maybe other good thing like me can say me, no, no, no. You can use that to cover a certain situation, something like that. But in my opinion, it's a slower, it has it has in the high crash property and the combo is not good. It's only, it's minus 14, instead of minus 12. So we're standing three, it's better in every situation, in my opinion. Okay, cool. Okay. And now uh, I, I'm, I'm missing one change that I will talk the, about, the, about it at the end. Yeah. Because I want to talk something about improve in the in the next patch. <laughs> I will ask for another. Okay, my change. <laughs> but now uh, we're going to talk about they improve the hitbox of, of this move to mm. make it hit you if you jump sometimes. They solve some some kind of problem with the every sweep, with this sweep, with this sweep, and with this sweep. I think in the past. You couldn't jump, or sometimes it it hits you if you try to jump. You know the low defeat the, the, oh. the low press button. But oh. now I think they remove it. Oh, okay, so like doing oh, so they don't have a lot of characters. Anyone that does lows, if you try to do a mid attack, it would just evade oh, yeah. it. So I think that's yeah. another change. But we can move past it. That's 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 just a generic change. Yeah. So now the last change that I want to talk is back four. They say that back four. Uh, decrease the distance between the character and the opponent with the move hits mm -hmm. okay because in the past if that hit you you could do fussy guard doing backdash crouch mm -hmm. try to do backdash crouch okay oh, on hit not back from okay. hit. okay this option now is good but you know it's only plus two so mm, I don't feel that the buff was very big because I feel also that the distance, even on hit of the back four, is very far. You know what I mean? Yeah. Check it. Don't move after get hit by the back four. Okay. Check. It's like sometimes you are very far. You know, very very far. So, in my opinion, uh. Feng is weak against a player who knows how, how to move against Feng because a lot of situations can be fussy guarded, okay? So back four is a very important tool to break that fussy guard, okay? Because, for example, after down four one, try to do side step left and crouch, okay? Side, side step to my left or your left? Yeah, to, to your left. Okay, your cool. Left. Okay, cool. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's option is good, but you know, this is 
only plus one and not did damage. Yeah. And also, check it. Check it. <laughs> you can... Okay, so... Uh, Feng... Oh, I, I can do that, okay? This is... But you know, the 19 frames, okay, to catch it. So, Feng had to use back four to break that fussy guard, okay? Okay. But the reward for break the fussy guard is not good enough even they buff the distance between Feng and the opponent when the back four land on hit. Okay. So, what I ask for Feng is, or a better uh, advantage after back four connect, yeah. or be very, very, very close to your opponent. This is the change that I want to ask for with Feng back four. Because at a very high level, that small, mm, what I f feel is that small change can make Feng very, very strong, you know? Yeah. Even he's a poking character, he's a character with a lot of evasive move, uh, but Feng needs to deal uh, cheap damage, you know? Very small damage, down four, down two, okay, sorry, not the one. <laughs> Back four, down four, one, one, two. So Feng needs something to stick the opponent to the ground, to make the opponent scared, scared of press. Pressing or, buttons. Yeah, of the fussy guard. Against a good character, for example, a good player, for example, Daniel Mado, mm -hmm. okay? Against Feng, always is block, uh, side step crouch, side step crouch, side wall, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's very difficult because if I know that he go to do a step and I get the back four, I get very, very, very small damage. Mm. How, how much? I don't know that. Only 14 damage, you know? Mm. So if I land three times in a row, back four in the same situation after down four one, mm -hmm. but I block down four one and do a, a step left. Okay, and get one, it's 14 damage, 14 damage, 14 damage. But if I do down four one, down four one, and he steps on block, yeah. and launch me, because you can launch the situation. Mm -hmm. It's like, I did at the correct read many times, but I, yeah, I got nothing or not too much, you know what I mean? Yeah. So what I feel, what I ask for Feng is to improve the back four situation after. Okay, cool. Is that all the patch notes done? Yeah, we, we uh, did the whole patch note part. Yeah. Okay, cool. So just briefly, what do you think, like just on a quick one, what do you think uh, the strengths and weaknesses are of the character? The strength of the character is now, uh, yeah. You, you talk about uh, season, four. Season, season four, okay. Yeah. Now he, he's more dangerous because dumbbag three on counter hit, because we're standing two on counter hit. You have to respect more the one, two, and the one, and the dumbbag one, two. So now you have to even think even more about to press the bottoms when you go to press bottom. Because on the past on season three, you got the a four two, sorry, a four two, the Kempo, the back four one, the, you, a lot of evasive move. But now he has good counter hits, okay? For example, press after Domba 1, okay? So, pam pam, wall, okay, blah, blah, blah. So, he's better pressing, but he has the same mistakes that in the past. If you know how to fussy guard Feng, a Feng needs to read in a correct way too many times, you know, too many times, because back four is the key to deal damage. Because the other homie move, like, uh, down 4, 3, plus 4, 4, 1, plus 2 are very slow. 4, 4, 4 is a good move to defeat the size step left, but it is 4, 4 and after 19 frames. So, very strong pressing, very strong making the opponent mm, respect you, but very weak opening good players. You know, uh, players who know how to move, who knows how to fussy, fussy guard, who knows the risk reward situation, because a good player will be will be hit by back four many 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 times mm. because he only needs to catch you once to make you you know in a very bad situation so in my opinion yeah that's a that's a strong point and the weak point from from Fen. okay cool and then the last the last one is if there was one change i, I know you already said it but it could be one possible change you only got one chance to change mm -hmm. one thing about thing what would that one change be if the developer said hey look you got one change what is it uh, mm, 
um, I want to, I will ask for um, make, improve the back four more. Okay, or if it is only plus two on hit, mm -hmm. uh, I will ask something for like plus three and closer, very, very close, mm -hmm. or plus five, plus six and uh, far on hit, you know? Okay, like this on hit is fine. Mm -hmm. This is If this is plus six, plus five, mm -hmm. but plus two and so far, uh, it's like you land the correct option, you did the correct read, and uh, you got nothing, you know? This is this, this is what I felt. So I asked for improve the back four. The back four is the reason uh, because Feng could be good, could be strong, very strong, you know? Mm -hmm. If you want to face character like Fakuram, like Leroy, Akuma, uh, top tier characters, you need has a reason to be scared of a uh, fast guard fan. And the reason is back four. This is my opinion. Maybe players like Hiro Malik, who is play, uh, playing Feng or Ni, uh, can say you a better to a better option. But in my opinion, back four is the key. Yeah, improve back four means improve the other options with Feng because back four cover the other options. You know what I mean? Okay, cool. Well, thank you very much for this episode, Kaipa. It's been a pleasure. Um, obviously, you're on social media. If you stream, let them know, man. What are your social media so they can follow you, man? Okay, my social media on Twitter is KaiperMG. You can follow me in that in, in Twitter. And I'm not using other social media at the moment. So, yeah, so KaiperMG is fine. And I will play a lot with Feng. And I will load a lot of new stuff with Feng that I'm discovering after many, many years playing Feng. So thank you, Kija. It's a pleasure for me to be here. Thank you for all your effort to make the Tekken community bigger and to help other people to learn. So thank you. Thank you for bringing me here. Thank you very much, man. I really, really appreciate that. That's humbling to hear from such a legend, legendary player, you know, and you've been around for quite some time as well. I think, we're, I think you might have been around the same time as me. I've been around for like over a decade now. So yeah, it's from, been, it's been yeah. Tekken, uh, Tekken 5, Dio. Yeah, taking 5 TR, yeah. Ah, oh, see, there we go, there we go. So, yeah, yeah, man, thank you very much for your time. And, yeah, remember to like this video if you look like it, subscribe and leave a comment. And, you know, if you're watching videos like this and you're like and subscribed, what are you doing? Subscribe. Take it easy, everyone. We're on to the next episode. Peace. Bye.